Beach. Come on, guys. What kind of crap is that, bro? Honestly. If you can sit there and you can try to defend some guy for sleeping with an underage girl, you know what I'm saying? Then your words mean nothing to me, bro. They don't mean a crap, man. And here I am. Someone says, Squeaky Panda says, Tuna's talking crap about me. Tuna can talk crap about me all she wants, bro. We're talking about a freaking woman that lives in a single wide trailer that her father owns. We're talking about a freaking woman that gets disability, you know, for, for, for a month, you know, per month. Doesn't go out and still goes out and, like, cuts grass and crap. We're talking about the same woman that freaking damn gave my, you know, gave my dad dope. That was my dad's freaking dope dealer. And you guys all know what you got. She even freaking posted a video of herself telling him that she's, I got you, pie, I got you. Same one. Baby Vapes, thank you so very much, sweetheart. Hopefully you're having a great night. Same one. Got mad that I called her a freaking drug dealer? My brother called her. My brother's got, got, got videos with hundreds and 200,000, 500,000 views. Calling this woman a drug dealer. Lady VSC, thank you so much, sweetheart. Says those negative Nancy Snowflakes got me post, got, got my post blocked on Facebook. You know what? I got blocked on Facebook last night too, all because I said that drugs and food are the same thing. <laughs> all because I said drugs and food are the same thing. Well, if you're so freaking fat and nasty and ugly and sweaty and smelly and gross. That you know what I'm saying? That you got to get mad when somebody calls somebody else fat. Then maybe you need to go lose some damn weight, bruh. Maybe you need to put the freaking Snickers bar down and lose a little bit of that freaking mass on your butt. Don't get mad at other people because they talk this crap about people being fat. You know what I'm You want to sit there and you want to talk bad about Charlie? Someone said back tits. <laughs> you want to talk bad about Charlie but for having, for having a consumption problem? Because he, he, he drinks a little too much? Well, you eat too dang much. Come on, is 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 uh, is, uh, is 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 a uh, drug? Is, is food not a drug? I get upset, you know what I'm saying? I want to smoke a joint, I want to drink a beer. These are these these uh, these uh, these other fatties, you know what I'm saying? They get depressed and stuff. They eat a burger. What's the difference? It's we're both hurt. We're both tearing ourselves up down. We're both we're both destroying ourselves. Whether it's glug 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 or whether it's chomp chomp chomp. And I've actually got to tell you, you know what I'm saying, damn. Uh, you know, I believe, you know, the alcohol and, and drug dependency is easier is easier to, to come back from than freaking, than, than, uh, than being, than having fat butt disease. You know what I'm saying? Hazel McMillan, much love to you. Back to you, sweetheart. Mwah, right there. Hank Hill, much love to you, brother. This is smoking a bowl for you, Charlie. I wish that I had a bowl, bro. <laughs> I ain't smoked in freaking damn days, man. Straight up days. But, um. But yeah, you know what I'm saying, damn. I mean, well, I mean, when when it when it comes down to what what tears you apart, you know what I'm saying? Um, what's the difference between a a a, a beer or a joint and a freaking hamburger? Like I said, the only the only difference is I think that you can get back from from drug and alcohol dependency better quicker than you can being being than having fat butt disease. You know what I'm saying? I can sit there and I can give up the joint and I can go to rehab for a month and I'll be okay. You know what I'm saying? If you got fat butt disease. You can't stop eating. You keep wanting to shoving your. You want to keep shoving Doritos and, and Tortitos down your face. You know what I'm saying? You know how long it's gonna take you to lose weight, bro? It's it, 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 there is no difference between between food and then dope when it comes to it, bro. Because you know what I'm saying, dude. You can take yourself over the edge. Someone says one is mind altering, bro. You don't think that you sit there and get sad and eat a burger and feel good? That, that, that's not mind altering. Food is mind altering, bro. That's why it's called comfort food. We get sad, we get upset or something, we eat us a burger and we're smiling again. Bro, it's mind altering. Don't you ever freaking damn uh, uh, forget that. Baby Vase, thank you so much. He needs to put the Snickers Snickers down. You damn right he needs to put the Snickers down. Lady Via says, told a dude if he loves Mike so much, hop off Charlie's page and run back to his boyfriend, Mike. It is worth it, the, the post block. I can't believe it, you know what I'm saying? They, 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 they blocked you because they told they, they told uh, breast, 
breast slob to go, you know, blow his boyfriend a little more. <laughs> it's crazy, you know what I'm saying? They can they can say whatever they want. There we go, rock and roll says cheeseburgers kill too. Damn right, cheeseburger. And they kill every single day. Guys, let me tell you, man, obesity is the number one freaking damn killer here in America. Obesity. Obesity is the number one killer. Number one leader from heart disease. It ain't it ain't freaking alcohol. Boyka, what's up, brother? What'd you say there, man? See you, buddy. Much love and respect to you, buddy. I hope you come to Sweden sometime and you can stay with me. Peace, buddy. Much love to you, man. Somebody said crack on Bridget. She's fat. <laughs> She's stupid. And they're, and they're lazy. They pay her mom $400 a week to come in the house and kind of run the broom around a little bit. And... Pull them cheeks apart and, you know what I'm saying? All of them over there, you know what I'm saying? They sit there and they got they to sit there and put their nose up in ass crack in order to get whatever the heck they want. You're not going to see that with me. I'm going to come forward and I'm going to tell it like it is. I'm going to say what I got to say. And I'll make my own money. Someone said he's a pedophile. Dang right, pedophile. Dude, he admitted. And this is funny, guys. Okay, so check it out. He admitted to it. Zach and Miri make a porno came out in 2008, guys. Zach and Miri made a porno, make a porno came out in 2008. And this was their anniversary story, he told. So they were obviously together since 2007. You go ahead and do the math yourself and you'll figure out how old she, how old she really was in 2007. Brown dogs, much love to you, sir. Do you prefer cocaine or whiskey? I'd prefer cocaine. <laughs> like I said, the drug, I mean, the, the beer and stuff like that, man, it brings me down, man. I've always been an uppers kind of guy. <laughs> So, but yeah, check it out, man. Go look it up. Zach and Mary make a porno. Came out in 2008. They were already dating for a freaking year. I don't give a damn if if, 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 if their family freaking damn lets you or not. I, uh, oh, Kai and Kendra. What's up, fat girl? <laughs> oh, Kendra right there, man. I can't believe it, man. She looks so much like Danny DeVito. It's gross. I mean, it's absolutely disgusting, dude. If I was her husband, bro, I'd cut my junk off. <laughs> gone and throw it out the freaking window. It's gone. <laughs> so, um, uh, yeah, but you know what I'm saying? Yeah, looking looking just like Danny DeVito. Where you at, Kendra? Piglet West, yeah. True, it's, it's true. And then, you know what I'm saying? If you're going to get mad that I call somebody else fat because you're fat, do something about your life, bro. Do some, don't just sit there and be like, oh, me, arr, 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 arr. donuts, pancakes, waffles. Stop eating, bro. Stop freaking stuffing your face with all kinds of lard and sweets. It's that freaking simple. Oh, you know, you want me to quit drinking and doing drugs and stuff like that? Well, why don't you quit stuffing your face with all kinds of fatty foods? It's that simple, bro. I ain't the only, you know what I'm saying? I'm not the only one. We all have our vices, you know what I'm saying? But if you're going to call me on my vice, I'm going to call you on yours, fatty. I'm going to call you on yours, fatty. Oh, and I'm the one uh, that that, call, that has call girls? Well, my brother is the one that was like, hey, look at this one. And I was like, holy crap, is that a grandpa fan? No, that was a call girl. Child protection services take their baby. Please take that baby away. Kyle Roberts, much love. Why is this Amy's daily blog? She's always in my biz, bro. This, this Amy, you know, this, we're talking about another freaking meth head, another crackhead that has nothing. Hank Hill, much love. Already 1,000 viewers. Shout out to all the haters right there, to all y'all haters. Uh, much love to you. But anyway, so man, uh, 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 Shamey, we'll call her Shamey. Shamey, you know what I'm saying, sits in her freaking damn, uh, in her tent and hopes for damn views and stuff. And she puts makeup on her drugged out face to try to look good. She's, she looks, she looks like freaking E.T. on Halloween. <laughs> Looking like freaking E.T. on Halloween. And just, you know, just like all of them. Even my own brother. My own brother has over 2 million subscribers and he's got to continue to try to make it on Charlie. He's got to continue, you know, my brother, he's always been the type, you know what I'm saying, you know, rule number one is ignore it. Ignore them. Don't, don't respond back. But he keeps responding back and talking about Charlie. Why? Because y'all want to hear about Charlie. Because y'all want to see Charlie, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Y'all don't even, y'all don't even want to see, y'all don't even want to see thick old boy no more. Joey, Joey Reyes, has Bridget ever cheated on Michael? Heck yeah, she has, bro. You know, she's, like, dude, she's, she likes girls, guys. 
They get together, they, they, they buy high-end prostitutes, and then they sleep with them together. And I'm not kidding. I'm not kidding whatsoever. They pay for freaking three ways. You saw, him, you saw her cousin in the videos that she slept with. Slept with her own cousin. You saw it. And it's still there. The whole, the one, that, the, the one that we all, y'all, the one where y'all were like, oh man, don't be drinking, don't be bringing alcohol to the house. Charlie's recovering. I can't believe you, Michael. You're going to sit there and have a party while, you're, while your brother's in, the, in, the, in the, uh, the pool house recovering? That was her cousin, guys. Look it up. All right, you know, I'm just, I'll go ahead and tell it. I'll leave it at you. You look it up. That was fun. Next, you know, you look it up. I don't care. <laughs> we popping all the live streams tonight. And it's funny, man. We got so many people talking about lawsuits and stuff. What's up, Kyle Roberts? His music career is really going to take off. Not. Yeah, he's going to dump all of Grandpa's money into this freaking damn rap career. And he's going to do nothing with it. You know what I'm saying? He's not even gonna—he's not even gonna live to 30. 